middle game of a three-game set, Myrtle Beach and Carolina. Pelicans trying to snap a five-game skid behind Duncan Robinson on the mound for the Birds, and he was sharp, striking out Corey Ray and Monte Harrison in the first, Weston Wilson in the second inning. Five strikeouts and five innings for Robinson. In the second, Jesse Hodges up and out for a solo home run, snapping a two-for-20 slump, and the Pelicans had a one-to-nothing lead. More runs in the second, Adonis Pala, who matched a career high with four hits, singles in Robert Garcia, and the Pelicans ahead 2-0. It's 2-1 in the third. Zach Short lining one into left center field for a single. That would bring in a run as Roberto Cairo would score, and Myrtle Beach led 3-1. Eddie Martinez in the sixth inning, lining one deep to left center, off the wall and kicking away from the left fielder, Trent Clark. Vimayel Machine racing around from first to score. Myrtle Beach had a 4-1 lead. Still in the sixth, Pala, another base hit trickling between third and short. That would bring in Martinez to make it 5-1. A wild pitch later would make it 6-1 in the frame. Then it's 8-3 in the ninth inning. Dakota Mekis getting the fly out from Jose Quas. And Myrtle Beach snaps a five-game skid with an 8-3 win over Carolina. Winning pitcher was Robinson. He's 3-3. Three and, three, and Mekis gets the last four outs of the game. So the Pelicans are 60 and 58, 17 and 31 in the second half, and Carolina falling to 57 and 60, 21 and 28. Powell of the story with four hits and two RBIs, two hits for Robert Garcia and Zach Short, reached base three times. He has reached base multiple times in six of the last 10 games. Rubber game of the three game set comes tomorrow at 6.05. Post game fireworks after the contest.